So donning PPE for someone in isolation that requires a mask and goggles. Again, you'll have the stop sign in front of their door and the PPE should be put on in the hallway. I will sanitize my hands before I start putting on my PPE. I'll start with the gown. Open that up. Tie the gown behind my neck. Make sure there's no overlap in the back of my uniform so that the gown covers everything. Get a mask, and there's a metal piece that covers your nose. And that goes over the ears. I'm gonna make sure that gets over your chin, and you clamp it down. The goggles go over the mask, and lastly, I would get my gloves. Making sure the gown gets underneath the gloves so I don't have any skin exposed. And if you prefer, you can poke a hole in the gown to keep it under the gloves. Now I would enter the room and perform the patient care. When I'm done with care, I would remove the PPE inside the patient room. My hands are the dirtiest, so I would want to get rid of my gloves first. And reaching in the palm of one hand, containing that in the other glove, reaching from the inside, turning that inside out, and throwing that in the garbage. And sanitize just to make sure I don't spread any pathogens to any other part of my body. I would remove the, glo the goggles and dispose of them or have them sanitized per facility policy. Again, the front of my mask and the front of my gown are considered the dirtiest. So I would reach to the back side of my mask, drop that in the garbage, and then reach to the back of my gown. And start from the top down and turn that inside out, making sure that no contamination gets onto my uniform by covering the front of the gown, throwing that in the wastebasket, and then sanitizing my hands.